my husband was a uh, Catholic, and I was a Mormon when I got married. So everybody in the ward knew that. But they were never, uh, when Gus would show up to or go to the uh, daddy-daughter dinners or the scout things or dinners that they would have the church, they just included him, just like he was a member. And Mitt was all, one of those, always made him feel very comfortable. After my husband did join the church, he was assigned to be the home teacher of the Romney family. And um, <clears throat> that he would visit them with a companion, another priesthood holder, once a month. They loved Gus because he was a police officer in our hometown of Arlington. And so he would take his hat, police hat, or the billy club, or the handcuffs. And I, re I know Taggart and probably the other two oldest would um, remember that very, very much. And they just loved him coming because he would play along with them. When my husband died 10 years ago, Mitt Romney happened to be the governor of Massachusetts then. And um, in the afternoon that we viewed him, uh, someone said, the governor is coming in. And so he and Anne and Taggart came in. When they went through the line, I gave, actually I gave him a hug and he said how sorry he was to hear that and how much that he enjoyed Gus when he was uh, alive and and he asked how I was doing and if there were anything that he could help me with. But I did thank him for coming and all my children did because they, for taking the time out of his busy schedule to come and pay respects to Gus and also to our family. And so the next day he was also in attendance at the funeral. I was told afterwards that he was asked to sit up on the stand where authorities sat, but he said no, he would sit with the mourners in the pews because he was there as a friend. But one thing I must say about Mitt is that there was nothing put on with Mitt Romney. It came from his heart. And when he would come over to talk to me or to um, shake my hand, you know it was genuine. And he would look you right in the eye. And he was very sincere. And always, uh, when he had asked how I was, I knew that he meant what he said.